Hi everyone, so I am doing my minimal makeup look, or well, this is mainly a summer look. So I was gonna call it minimal makeup, but let's be real, it's not minimal makeup, but it's less makeup than I usually wear. This is my everyday routine. So I'm going in with Milani's Prime Light Primer, and I put that all over my face. I am wearing sunscreen, I'm wearing uh, Cora sunscreen all over my face in SPF 30 so I put that on prior like early in my routine but um, I just went ahead and put on that prime light because I love it and then I fill in my brows I'm using benefit precisely my brow in number three I just kind of feather the front of my brows and then define the top and the bottom and I find honestly if I do my brows like it makes such a big difference I love using benefits high brow to highlight under my eyebrows I feel like it brings a lot of light to my face and sometimes if I'm literally gonna do nothing to my face like not even wear foundation I'll just do my brows and highlight under them I don't know I just feel like it makes the biggest difference so I'm using max semi sweet palette this is the semi sweet times nine palette I think this shade is called outre it's just a mustardy brown shade a matte mustardy brown shade anything you have you can even use your bronzer if you want to but this is just what I've been doing every single day I just take a fluffy brush and I put that all through my crease and I just kind of like dust it on my lid put it as you can see I'm just being generous with it and I'm kind of putting it in the crease and all over my lid that's it for eyeshadow honestly that's it so I'm gonna curl my lashes which makes a huge difference because for this look I just pile a lot of mascara on I'm not even gonna lie I use this essence lash princess I think this is lash extensions or false lash effect mascara it's the one in the green and I love this because if I build it up I find that it just makes my lashes Kind of like spidery almost, but I love that look. So if you get any mascara on your lid, just use the brush to clean it up. So for my foundation, I have been using this CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Elixir Foundation every single day. This is in number 725. I love it. So I'm just using a beauty blender. And this is the darker shade because I have self tanned this past week. So this is my summer shade, if you will, even though it's still not that deep. But I just blend that in with a beauty blender. And I don't really use a ton of concealer in the summers, but I will put on a little bit of like Benefit Erase Paste. That's just a little bit of a correcting color and I kind of press it in. That's as much as I use right there and I press it into the eyes. I don't even set under my eyes with powder because it's such a little amount of product and I don't find that it creases. Uh, I went back in with that eyeshadow and swept that under the eyes and then I like to wear a nude in the waterline. I find that it brightens my eyes and it gives me a very awake look. So I put that Benefit Highbrow in the inner corners and then I'm going to use NARS Larger Than Life in Rue Bonaparte for my waterline. This is my favorite trick to do. I do this all the time pretty much. I just love having a nude shade in the waterline. And then the contrast of using mascara. This is MAC Extended Play Giga Black Lash Mascara. So I just put a little bit of that, hit my lower lashes with that, and I find that this is just like the perfect amount of makeup on my eyes for me. And for my face, I love going in with this Cover Effects Bronzer. I think this is either Sunswept or Sunlight. I'm, I'm not sure which one it is, but it's the bronzer one, not the highlighter. But I love these um, Cover Effects drops because they just blend into the skin really, really well. And they give this really nice glow to the skin, but a bronze effect. So I top that off with Hourglass Ambient Bronzer in Luminous Bronze. I love this bronzer because I think it just it's a perfect bronzer for the summer because it just kind of gives that face a really pretty glow I've been loving the NARS liquid blushes this is in orgasm which is a beautiful peachy color I just use a stippling brush I put it on the back of my hand and then I stipple that on and then I topped it with peach delight this is a beautiful color from Laura Geller and I think it just gives like a really nice peachy glow this is the Milani Spotlight Bronzer or Afterglow Bronzer in Spotlight. I love this, or no, bronzer. 
highlighter. You guys knew what I was talking about. I love this highlight. It's super glowy and very affordable. So I just put that on my cheekbones and in the inner corners of my eyes for that little bit of extra glow. I'm lining my lips for a nude lip. This is Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat in Iconic Nude. And then I'm topping it with, I think it's called skin deep or bare skin skin deep i will have the name on the screen from mark jacobs i love this nude combination and this is like my everyday summer look if you want to do something besides a nude lip then you can do a pop of color with this look my favorite pop of color is this le orange from ysl this is my absolute go-to orange lip it's number 13 and I think it's beautiful in the summertime with glowy skin so you can use a pink or anything but this is just my pop of orange that I go to for a bold lip that's it for this summer makeup routine hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing two different lips and this light makeup look subscribe if you're not already thanks for watching I'll see you all in the next video bye